Hi everyone, welcome to Mall of Fitness on IC Digital. My name's Kim and I'm gonna be taking us through our full body workout today with weights and mini bands. We got 18 exercises, one minute on, 10 seconds off. That 10 seconds will kind of be our transition. We're gonna run through each exercise two times. In between our set of the two, um, two sets, I will give you a minute and a half exercise. So what I would recommend is if you have two sets of weights, a heavier and a lighter, couple bands, usually they come in a pack. If you have the whole pack, just bring up or pull, them, pull those out. Um, a mat if you have, water bottle and towel. So I'll give you a moment to grab that. And just before we get started here, you'll see above there is the link for our Patreon page. This is just a page um, that you could check out for as little six cents a day, offers a little extra support for myself and the producer of this channel. Uh, and there are also some perks to that. You get the videos um, released a little bit earlier and question and answers with me once a month. So if that interests you, check it out. We definitely would appreciate your support. All right, let's get started here with um, a bit of a warm up. Let's start in our downward facing dog. For most, if any of you take my classes often, know that I like to start with this. It's just a great way to open up the back side of the body. So let's just walk our dog out here. Bending one leg at a time, getting into the calves, hamstrings, and then find some stillness. Sink those heels a little closer down towards the earth. Let the head and neck hang heavy here. And then from here, walk your feet up to your hands, coming into a forward fold. Any tension in the hamstrings or lower back, put a slight bend in the knees. And then as you inhale, roll up nice and slow, one vertebrae at a time. And then we'll just get a little movement here before we get started. So legs straddled, just bending one leg at a time, coming into a lateral lunge. Keep the chest up. And the leg that's bent, that is the heel that you want to push through to come into standing. A few more seconds here, and then we'll get into our first exercise, which is going to be a squat with an overhead press. So I'd recommend probably at lighter weights, little heavier band, the band's gonna go around the legs, weights in the hands. All right, we'll stop here, let's grab your weights, and we are gonna get started with our first exercise in 10 seconds, band around the thighs. Heavier to lighter weights, we got one minute on here. So let's get started. Coming down into a squat, press up as you stand up. Pressing into the band, giving a little bit more resistance, getting those glutes engaged. Weights are directly overhead here as you press up. Halfway there. Pressing through those heels as you stand up and sinking that booty back as you come down into your squat. Three, two, one, rest. 10 second rest. From here, keep the band around your thighs. We're gonna move into a curtsy lunge Three, with an upright two, row. So one, let's move to the left first. Right leg behind the left as you come to center, upright row. Alternating legs here. With the upright row, bringing the weights to chest height. Keep the shoulders down as you row up. Shoulders back with the curtsy lunge. As you stand up, press through that front leg. So right here, pressing through this left heel 
as you stand up, this side pressing through the right. Chest is up as you lunge back. chest press. Weights are right above the eyes as you bring them up. Five more seconds. Three, two, one, rest. Grab your lighter set of weights for this is one for sure. We're gonna move into a jump squat with a punch. Three, two, so, one, go. standing here, jump low, punch. Up, low. Quick movement with the feet as you jump and bring your feet together. Chest stays up. And sink that booty low as you come down into your squat. Halfway there.
up on your feet. Bring the band below the knees. We're gonna step back Three, with two, a row. One, so, go. right leg goes back, row. As you step back, arms down. We're gonna stick with the right leg for now. At halfway, we're gonna move to the left. Really squeezing the shoulder blades together as you pull those arms in. Elbows at your side. Halfway there. Switching to the left leg. Arm straighten as the left leg comes back. Pull those arms in as you step that left leg forward.
Almost through this one. Keep that core tight. Stay with your breath here. Three, two, one, rest. Back up on our feet. From here, actually, we're going to Three, get rid of two, the band. One, go. Put it around our I'm at, I'm wanting, I want you to cut that again. You're going to hate me. I don't know my issues today. I've just been having a, I don't know. I'm just off in general. This is the second time I've tried to shoot. Ugh. All right. We're going to get started now. Okay, for this next one, all we're gonna need is our band. Grab the medium one, put it around your forearms, and we're gonna get into a push-up with a spider crawl. So, push-up, spider crawl. If the push-up from here is too much, come down to your knees, push-up, come onto your toes, spider crawl. Pick your poison here. Halfway there. I want you to keep moving wherever you are, but I also want you to push yourself to your limits. Stepping out of your comfort zone a little. With our next one, we're gonna take this medium band Put it around our ankles Two, one, and grasp rest. our lighter weights. Right around, right away here. Around the ankles, grab your lighter weights. Two, Starting with the right leg, a little pulse out and bring the arms up. Lateral raise with leg extension, getting into that right glute. If this is too much, maybe you just do the legs, then the arms. Alternating at the halfway point, we're moving into your left leg. Halfway there. All right, grounding down through the right foot, left leg up. Slight bend in your standing leg. I'm feeling it in my shoulders with this. So I'm gonna start alternating. Maybe you drop down to lighter weights. Three, two, one. One more of that. Here we go. Okay, from here, keep the band around your um, ankles. Actually slide it down to your feet. We're gonna move into a bicycle with skull crushers. So. Arms, extend straight overhead here. Alternating the feet. Pull the knee in as the weight comes down. Alternating legs with each movement here. And only moving from the elbows for your skull crushers. With these bicycles, this is where you may notice that the band may want to move and start rolling up on you. Three, two, one. We're going to stay down here, grab two bands, heavier band around the ankle, lighter band, around the wrist. Roll on to your stomach. Superman's here with the band. So as you inhale, arms and legs come up, pull the arms in, extend, come back down, inhale. As you're pulling, working those lats.
Keep that gaze down as you come up, protecting the neck, and keeping the tension in your bands. Rolling back onto your back, pull the band up over your thighs, heels together. We're going to move into frog pulses with a fly. So, arms come up over as you bring the legs, uh, hips up, exhale, hips come down, arms come down. Soles of the feet to touch here. Slight bend in the arms. Halfway there. Really squeezing your glutes here at the top. down we're gonna stay low onto our mat coming onto all fours just meeting your band right now keep the band exactly where it is we're gonna move into alternating arms and legs here extend the left arm right leg getting into a little core work gaze is down that band from rolling up. I'm starting to do that. Really reaching in opposite direction as you bring your arm and leg up. Two more exercises after this and then we get our break. From here we're going to use the band again just the band Coming up onto the knees, and we're just going to move into tricep extension. We're going to start with moving the right, left arm to your chest, pulling straight down. If you want to work the core a little, lean back. At the halfway point, we're going to switch arms, moving into working the left tricep. Right arm is going to be stationary. Switch it. Left arm down, right arm up at your chest. Leaning back a bit, gauging that core. Shoulders down, out of your ears. One last exercise here in 10 seconds and we're gonna have our minute and a half rest. For this last one, we're moving into I always forget, night hawks left arm down right arm up Jeez. you're gonna have to cut that again I'm lying. I'm sorry you're gonna fucking hate me All right, for this last one, we're moving into night hawks. Left hand down, coming into a side plank. Right arm comes up, exhaling, come down. At the halfway, we're gonna switch. Right hand will be your supporting. Left arm's coming up. If this is too much from here, you could drop down to your knees. Get ready to switch. 
opposite. I'm gonna move this way just so my back's not to you. Right hand down, left arm up. As if you're giving yourself a hug, wrap that arm around you and then straight up. Last 10 seconds and we got our break. One minute break here. A minute and a half, I should say. One, rest. All right, let's take that break. Grab some water, towel off. <clears throat> and then get ready to run through these exercises one more time. If you're liking this workout, please give us a thumbs up. If you're liking the channel, subscribe. New videos are out every Sunday night, Monday morning, as I always say, depending where you are in the world. Um, yes, and we'll get started here in just a moment. Catch your breath. And one last thing, as I always say, leave comments at the bottom. I'm always open to feedback and what you guys want to see more of. This channel is for you, the viewers. So I want to see what is on demand, what everyone's wanting right now. Okay, let's get started or get ready to run through these. Once again, we're gonna start with the squat with the overhead press. Three, two, one, Heavier band around the thighs. Coming into your squat, pressing up. We got about 22 minutes of work. That's with our 10 second rest breaks. So let's push through this. We've ran through these exercises once. You know what's coming at you. Halfway there. If you need to come down in the weight a little bit for the second round, honor your body. Squeezing those glutes at the top. Five more seconds. Three, two, one. From rest. here, we're moving into the curtsy lunge with the upright row. I'm gonna switch Three, up my weights. We're gonna move two, to the left first. One, right leg behind the left, coming to center, center, upright row. Alternating direction. Chest is up. through your right heel as you stand and then the left on this side might start to feel burn in these shoulders if you need to skip the upright row just hold the weights here at your side we're almost through this keep pushing we got five more seconds three two one from rest. here slide this band around your ankles we're going to move into the plank rows with a plank jack, jumping jack. Starting with the row. Left arm, right arm, plank jack, back to rowing. If this is too much, remember, just stick with the rows, come down to your knees. Or you can do a row from the knees, try come up, plank jack. Keep moving here with me. Almost through. Two, One more row. One. Push. Rest. 
Okay, you guys got this. Good. Let's roll straight onto your back. Quick, easy transition. Slide the band over your thighs. Glute bridges with the chest press. As the hips come up, arms up over your head. Pressing through those heels. Let's keep that heart rate up. Keep pressing the thighs out into the band and squeezing the glutes at the top. From this one, we're going to move back up onto our feet. Alternating leg, reverse lunge with the hammer curl. Stay with your heavier band. Maybe you drop down in your weights to your medium or lighter weights. Three, two, with the hammer curl, one. palms are facing in, not up to the sky. Starting with the right leg, step back, curl up as you come back to standing. As you step back, coming straight down so that front leg Knee stays stacked on top of the ankle. Halfway there. Staying with your breath. Fifteen more seconds here. May start to feel burn in those biceps. Means you're building strength, building muscle. Ooh. Three, two, one. Rest. Stay on your feet. Keep these weights in your hand. We're gonna move into the jump squat with the punch. Punching one more down two, in our squat. One. Feet together. Let's jump down into our squat. Punch. Alternating arms. Feet together. Squat down. Finding your rhythm. Getting that booty low as you come into your squat. For the next one, step back so with the row. Band stays where it is. Maybe keep these medium lighter weights. If you want, you could grab through your heavier for your row. We're gonna start with alt alternating legs here. Right leg back first. Step back, step forward, and row. Alternating. Arm straight as the leg straightens. Once again, chest is about 45 degrees. Squeezing the shoulder blades as you pull. Shoulders stay out of your ears. sweat on here. Maybe my apartment's hot today. <laughs> Stay with me. Ten more seconds. And there the band wants to roll. Three, two, one, rest. From here, we are going to slide this off. Three, two, Stay with our heavier one. weights. Just like our crescent pose, we're going to drive that right knee in, come into 
our single leg a dead lift. Left leg stays forward for this full minute. Weights just at your side. Try not to lock that front leg out. Halfway there. Chest stays up as you come down. So pull those shoulders back. We just worked on our back. Try not to round forward. 15 more seconds on this leg. Whew. Last one. Three, two, one, rest. Quick, easy transition. Right leg forward, left leg back. Let's step it back and get ready to move using the abs. Drive that left knee in, step that left leg back, come into your single leg and deadlift. As best as you can, roll that left hip down, squaring your hips to your mat. Last 10 seconds. Let's try getting two more. Last one, drive that knee in and come forward. Come back up to standing. From here, all we need is our band for our lateral squats. Getting that heart rate up if it's not already. Stepping over to the right to center. Alternating here. You pick the pace, faster you go, more calories you burn. Heart rate's gonna keep going up. Chest is up. Good news, we're halfway over with this set. Pick up that pace for these last 15 seconds. Come on, you got this in you. Smile on your face, stay with your breath. We're gonna keep the band around our thighs here and move into our bear crawls with the weight. Remember, the more weight in your hand, the little more resistance you're gonna have. So we're gonna crawl forward and back on our mat. Knees are hovering about an inch, inch and a half above the mat. Getting that core engaged. And then come back. If you have the space, you can make your strides a little longer. Five more seconds here. Two, one, rest. All right, let's get rid of these weights. Medium band. We're gonna go into our push-up with the spider crawl. Band stays around the wrist. Push-up, spider crawl. Left knee to our right knee to right elbow. Left knee to left elbow, alternating. Holding the plank is too much. Drop down to your knees for your push-up. Come back up onto your toes. Spider crawl. 
And if this is all too much, maybe you just hold this, do the spider crawl, get into the obliques. Fifteen seconds left. Try getting two more, maybe three. One more push up. Three, two, one, rest. Let's get up on our feet. Maybe grab our lighter weights. We're gonna go into three, the leg extensions two, with the lateral one, raises. Go. Starting with the right. Leg comes out, lateral raise. This is your option, leg, then arm, or together. It's gonna work the core a little more, burn those arms out a little more. At the halfway point, we're gonna move to the left leg. So the leg extension is just a little movement. Legs coming out about 45 degrees. There. Switch, left leg comes out. And why it's a little movement is because if we extend too far back, we start using the lower back muscles. And that's not what we're trying to target here. We're trying to get into the glutes. Three, two, one. From here, Rest. we are going to get onto our backs. Keep the other band close because we're going to use them both right away. Moving into the bicycles with the skull crusher. So arms overhead, pull the left knee in, bring the weight down, right knee in, weight comes up. Alternating here. Keeping those elbows squeezed in. Shoulders relax down your back. Halfway there. We're almost done, guys. Stay with me. Only a few exercises left. Press up. Inhale as you come down. Three, two, one, rest. 
From here, we're gonna get rid of the weights. Keep the band around your thighs. Three, two, one. And we're moving into alternating arms and legs here. Right arm out, left leg. And switch. Gaze is down, belly button to spine. Point the toes as you extend the leg out. Thumb up to the sky for the arm that's extending out. Shoulders relax down your back. Halfway there. Two more exercises after this. You guys are doing great. We're almost done. Easy transition, we're staying down on our mat. Just slide this mat, um, band off. Come onto your knees, we're gonna get into our tricep extensions. Starting with the right, left arm is stationary. Bring that right arm down. Elbows not moving, just moving, or sorry. Shoulders not moving, just moving from the elbow. And if you wanna engage the core a little, lean back. One more exercise after this. We're on the home stretch. We're switching to the left arm at the halfway. Halfway there. Getting into that left tricep, right arm is stationary. Keep that core tight. All right, we're done with the bands. Put those bands aside. We're gonna move into this Nighthawk here. First with the left arm down, right arm up. At the halfway, we are gonna switch. And here we're gonna switch. The timer went out, so I'm just using my whole timer. We got 30 seconds and then we are done. Last 10 seconds here. And three, two, one, we are done. Let's get into our stretch. Since we are down here, we'll just start from the mat. Let's step that right leg forward. Getting into those hip flexors. For those of you that take my classes quite often know I like to do this one. I think it's needed, much needed in everybody. With a, Quite a, with the amount of sitting that I'd say majority of us do, whether it's work, school, just driving. So getting into this left hip flexor here, the psoas. As you exhale, just finding a little bit more softness into that hip, and then switching it out. Left leg comes forward, drop the hips down, getting into the right hip flexor. <sighs> Bring that left leg back. Let's come up onto into standing. Take a straddle the feet and we're gonna fold over. Folding the chest over the legs. And just hang out here for a second. Let that head and neck hang heavy. If it feels good, you can sway side to side. 
And then plant your right hand down onto the mat, right between your legs, and as you inhale, sweep the left arm up to the sky. If it feels okay on your neck, maybe gaze up towards your left fingertips. And then exhale, bring the left hand down, inhale, sweep the right arm up. And then exhale down. As you inhale, sweep the arms behind your head and let's just get a little shoulder stretch here. Inhale, come up nice and slow. Heel toe the feet together. As you inhale again, sweep the arms up overhead. Bend the left arm behind your head, right elbow grabs for that left elbow getting into your triceps. And then switching it out. From here, as you inhale, bring the arms out to the side. Exhale, left arm crosses over the right, getting into the shoulder. If you want to get into the neck a little bit as well, drop that right ear down to the right shoulder and relax both your shoulders down your back. Just a little deeper stretch here. Inhale, bring the neck back up, bring the arms out, and then switch it out. Right arm across your chest, drop that left ear down. If you did so on the other side. And then come back to standing, shake it out. Thank you guys for joining me once again. Look forward to putting up another class for you next week. Remember, if you like this workout, please give us a thumbs up. Until next time.